Welcome to an unboxing that has been requested many times. There's a lot of anticipation going on. Yes, this is the unboxing of the AMD FX processor. So I've only got one of them here today, but there are actually a number of different FX processors. So there's the 8 core FX 8150, which is what I have inside here, at least I think so. There's the a slightly slower 8 core FX. There's also a 6 core FX, so that's a 6000 series. And then there's also 4 core FX, and that's the 4000 series. So, what FX processors all have in common is that they are AM3 Plus processors. So these are based on the bulldozer architecture from AMD. They are all unlocked for ultimate overclocking and... I guess that's pretty much it. We have more performance, more unlocked CPUs, and just generally a lot of excitement going on right now on the AMD side. So, uh, what I find inside the, there we go, unlocks, oh, I mean unlock the world's first eight core desktop CPU, which it is, right here, okay. Maximum performance, more cores, the power you crave at every price point, cool. Innovative architecture, so this all new architecture for maximum flexibility and efficiency. It's funny they should mention that because that is one of the key things about the bulldozer architecture. So each of those eight cores is not necessarily a full core in the traditional sense, but what AMD has allowed through their creative engineering is almost eight full cores of performance by sharing certain aspects of two cores together. Okay, so two cores will share sort of one component that gets used less and then we'll have dedicated components so that they can still spit out most of the performance of a full core. So very, very cool stuff. Uh, next, industry leading price per performance. That's not really a new thing. We're all used to that on the AMD side. All AMD FX processors are unlocked to allow the maximum tunable performance. So AMD is basically going, okay, you know what? Forget the whole lockdown thing. We're going back to the Athlon XP days, folks, because every one of these CPUs, you can overclock just by adjusting the multiplier, adjusting the core voltage, and testing for stability. There is no tuning FSB or tuning base clock or adjusting RAM dividers or whatever, whatever finicky stuff. Nope. You take it, you turn up the frequency, and then you're happy. That's it. It comes with a t-shirt. At least this kit does. And also comes, get this you guys, you guys are going to love this, with an epic belt buckle. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys like how big this here belt buckle is. I mean, you know, if, if AMD, what, if we didn't already know that AMD is an Austin, Texas based company, I think we know now. So there you go. All right, let's go ahead and take my first look and probably one of your first looks, depending on when this video comes out, at the AMD FX 8-core 8150, I'm sorry, 8150, I believe. Yeah, 8150 CPU. So there's some seals on here that I'm going to go ahead and break. Got it. And this one. Got it. Okay. Oh, 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 there's the CPU. There's the CPU. I can touch it. I can touch it. No, it's got plastic over it. It's okay. Um, experience supercharged responsive gameplay and mega multitasking performance with the AMD FX 8-core processor Black Edition, world's first 8-core desktop, unlocked and overclockable, and it has AMD Turbo Core technology, which allows the cores to overclock themselves even if you're not comfortable overclocking the CPU on your own, in spite of the fact that with an unlocked CPU, overclocking is quite easy. Okay, please read this first. Prior to installing your AMD FX CPU, go to your motherboard manufacturer's website and download the latest BIOS. This is very, very important. All right, we've got an instruction manual. Inside you'll find a certificate of authenticity, a three-year warranty, and installation instructions. We've got an AMD AM3 Plus 8150 CPU, which I'll show you in more detail later, as well as an unlocked FX sticker for your case. And finally, we have an AMD approved heatsink fan combo made by AVC, evidently. Hey, pretty nice one too, okay? We've got four heat pipes on this guy and a 60 mil fan. And here is a very fascinating fact for you guys. Look at this. Does this look familiar? Does this look like every other AMD heatsink from like the last five years? That is because AM3 Plus is 
fully compatible with AM2, AM2+, and AM3, and even many socket 939, and even many socket 754 heat sinks. So as long as it can handle the thermal output of the FX series chip, which is actually not that high by the way, it is capable of fitting on an AM3 Plus board and CPU. Very cool. All right, so let's take out the chip itself and have a quick look. Actually, there's something else I want to show you guys really quick. Okay, so I'm going to open this up. So we have a Crosshair 5 motherboard here. So this is part of AMD's 900 series chipset boards. This is made by ASUS. So there's a black socket. That is an AM3 Plus socket, so if you're not sure if your socket is AM3 Plus compatible, all you have to do is check the color. Um, although there aren't any natively AM3 Plus motherboards at this time that are not featuring 900 series chipsets. So that is 970, 990X, or 990FX is what you're going to want. What's cool about these platforms too is AMD is really taking gaming very seriously with this platform. So not only do you have eight cores of unlocked overclockable goodness, but you've also got full SLI and full Crossfire compatibility on the 900 series boards where the manufacturer licenses those technologies. So the Crosshair 5 formula is Crossfire ready, SLI ready, supports dual channel DDR3 memory, and supports an eight core CPU in a single socket. So thank you for checking out my unboxing of the 8150 FX CPU from AMD. It sure does feel good to see that FX badge on the top of a heat spreader again. And don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos.